down here at the Wisconsin FTC Championship. Checking with team number 10 at 686 Phoenix. This team has already won uh, two qualifiers under the belt. And looking really hot here at this competition. Can't wait to talk about more about the road. We got Jared and Noah here. And wow, we got an eight bar linkage, cool intake. Uh, they even added the tape measure, guys. Uh, and some uh, interesting weight distribution on their drivetrain. I also want to talk about here on Behind the Bot. So let's start out here uh, with this eight bar linkage and let's kind of show that off and uh, talk me about uh, how this works. Yeah, so this is a eight bar linkage. It was designed by the things that used to help handicap people get in the pool. So it actually, it goes up parallel and goes down parallel, which we like a lot. And just start out as four bar linkage and then we add it on. So you did specifically the inspiration come from uh, that feature there? Or you're like, hey, we kind of had this thought. Let's look for real world examples. Tell me about how you came up with it. Uh, yeah, it started out uh, just looking at different designs for different lifts, different ideas. We thought about just a drawer slide idea. And then we saw the four bar linkage, thought it looked very nice. So we continued to look in. The original idea to look at a four bar linkage kind of came also from that handicap pool thing. And then we just invested more time and research and found that this was the best one for us. And continuing on this robot here, a couple of the cool features. What do you want to run us through? All right, so I guess right back here in the front, we have our capstone piece. And so the preface of it, it's on top of the cart, so you can't move it back. But the preface of it is that when it comes down, it's like a sleeve design. And so we'll back up the robot as soon as we're latched on, and it comes off just like that. Simple and easy, and we purposefully designed it so that if we do have another partner who's able to reach up high with their lift, they can also put their, they can cap the same tower as us, because you can cap the same tower. So if we have another good team uh, who can reach that high, it's great for points, and it's, yeah. It's great for us, at least. Uh, as you guys have gone through this competition season, I noticed uh, an improvement with the uh, tape measure and the compliant wheel on here. Uh, so can we talk a little about, uh, you know, obviously we, the tape measure is a popular thing. What made you guys say, hey, this is definitely what we want to go with for our strategy? Yeah, so when we were running autonomous earlier, especially in our first tournament, we found that we were bumping the other teams quite a bit. So we decided for our safety and for other team safeties, it's the best, but I think the thing has had the most impact on is our end game. When we pull out that base, we're able to reach around, and if you can bend the tape measure around the wall, you avoid all the blocks, and you easily park in the end game, and it really helps with getting that spacing in that tight corner. Lastly, I want to uh, follow up with your uh you know, mechanic wheel is something that a lot of teams use, but I noticed something about it. You kind of have these very hefty weights on both sides, and you're, you're telling me that uh, it's all in regards to, to balance and making sure that right. Tell me a little bit about how you discovered that and why did you decide to go with these, these giant cylinders on uh, the corners of your robot here? <laughs> right. So mechanics rely on slippage. They are rollers on a wheel. And so along with that, some of the weight will come into effect there. And we tried a few different things. These are steel weights. Uh, we've been asked if they are lead, but they are steel. Um, and we found that putting them diagonally from each other keeps us strafing straight, because running forward and back is pretty simple, but strafing is when things get a little bit complicated. And so adding those steel weights onto the front left and back right really helps us straight, strafe straight. Well, Phoenix, I love this team. Uh, as mentioned, already uh, two wins under their belt. Of course, looking for a win here at States. Who knows? Maybe the World Championships coming up as well. So good luck here at States. Hope to see you guys at the World Championships as well, too. Thank you. Thanks for watching. If you want more fun content, be sure to subscribe and ring the bell to be notified about our latest videos. You can also directly help support fun by visiting our Patreon at patreon.com forward slash first updates now or by subscribing at twitch.tv forward slash first updates now. Thanks to all of our co-executive producers on Patreon and tier two plus subscribers on Twitch keeping fun loud, live, and independent.